I'm Bailey. I'm Jessica. And I'm Sam. And today we're going to teach you how to use the green screen. The app we're using today is called TouchCast and it's free on the App Store. One tip would be to not wear green or yellow in front of the green screen while you're trying to film because you will blend in. Okay, so today we're just going to show you the basics on how to use the green screen app. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to your projects. You go to add clip and then you'll probably, you can either import a new video clip or import a clip from a project, which could be from like your iMovie. And what we're going to choose is record in studio with camera. So this is a live demonstration and that's Jesse. So what we're going to do first to get Jesse out of the way so we can see Bailey is go to our camera and then press swap. And there is Bailey. So on the camera part, to actually get to the green screen effects, we have to go to effects. So the color part, you just click that and that's what um, gives you your background. So with this, you can change it by going to these pictures right here and you can pick any background you want. So if you want to pick this, now Bailey is in <laughs> a winter wonderland and you definitely cannot see her head now. So we are going to change that. And then you can also go to albums and these are all the pictures. <laughs> and then we can change it to Shrek. And <laughs> this is the picture we took earlier with Jess and Bailey and Shrek is just, you know, giving them a nice squeeze. <laughs> okay, so you can also add filters when you're on effects. So right now we can add some cool olden days cowboyish filters. And then next you can go to whiteboard. That's just a tutorial, but our tutorial is way better. So on whiteboard, you can do things like draw. So if you press marker, you can draw on Bailey. <laughs> um, if you do text, you can pick what kind of font for text you want and just type it in. So next we are on titles. So to get the titles, you just click that and here you can edit your titles and pick um, the title you want. So if you press new title, you have a bunch of options for what you can use. So let's do a news report one. And then you just tap it and type in Bailey. And there you have your title. And with this, you can time it to take to um, say how many seconds you want it on, or you could choose to have it stay on forever. And then you can go to a next title, and all the titles you choose will appear at the bottom. So then you can do another, another title, just this random one. And if you just keep hitting next title, you can switch through it and um, edit them um, how you please. And you can also click to add to hide the title when you don't need it. So you just hide it. And next we are going to go to V apps. So V apps is kind of confusing. There's a lot of familiar things you can see. Um, so there's web page, photo, Google Maps, video, and YouTube. You can touch one of them and then it'll appear on the green screen. So if you want something from a school project that you want to insert in there from Google Drive. So if we went to something like YouTube and then searched on YouTube, choir. So when you search choir on YouTube, YouTube videos come up. And with YouTube videos, you can just click on the one you want. So we want only boys allowed from Britain's Got Talent and if you press use um, you can choose to either get the full video or get 30 seconds of the video. We like to go big 
not go home. So we're going to do the full video. It's at 100 now. And guess what? It appears right next to Bailey. So you just press play if you want to play it. Pause if you want to pause it. Get some sound if you want to get some sound. And it's playing right next to Bailey. She's watching it. Actually, she's not watching it because it's a green screen. It's not actually here. Sad day. Ooh, I can use an effect with that. Is there like a sad one? That's exactly what I wanted. So, you can adjust the size of the video if you want it totally covering Bailey. Um, you can move it around by touching this cross um, arrow thing. Um, you can get rid of it by just pressing this minus and then re let it reappear by clicking that. Um, press edit um, and then you'll see the title and the link to it. Um, you can make it play automatically. You can pause playbacks if a user interacts. Um, and just if you explore this, you'll see other cool things you can do with YouTube videos. All right, we hope that you enjoyed our video and learned a lot about how to use the green screen.